Hello, adventurers, and welcome to this educational walkthrough of Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion with Sam Wise from Mahalo. For more Oblivion videos, go to mahalo.com slash oblivion walkthrough. Be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe to this video. Happy day. Aren't you off to a good start? That's important. For me. Really, your work is going to save me a lot of time. The Grey March is upon us, and the ordering begins. Armies of order sweep my realm. Death, destruction. Then I have to pick up the pieces. And there are always lots of pieces. I don't like it. Having to rebuild my realm every era. Sometimes I forget where things go, like New Sheath. I can never remember where it belongs. You'll change that. Break the cycle. You'll stop Jigalag, and I'll have my realm to come back to. I've never actually tried that before. Why not? Something has to work. Once, I dug a pit and filled it with clouds. Or was it clowns? It doesn't matter, it didn't slow them down. To be honest, it wasn't the best idea. And it really began to smell! <gasps> Must have been clowns. Clouds don't smell bad, they taste of butter. And tears. But this is all new! A fresh idea! Something I hadn't thought of, until I did. It's sure to work even though it might not. Now, you'll need the respect of my citizens. They'll need a leader, someone to look up to when I'm gone. They're the backbone of any great land. Except where the backbone is an actual backbone. Ever been to Malakath's realm? Oh, nasty stuff. But back to the business at hand. You'll need to control one of the carts of madness. Replace a current duke. Or Duchess, whichever. That will command respect. The people will rally around you. You'll have their love, their admiration, their complaints. Whatever. As long as it keeps them on our side. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Absolutely not. Well, yes, absolutely. Bit of a shame for them. But sometimes, you need to break a few eggs, or skulls. There are rules, though, even in the Isles. Rituals and rules. You need to follow them. Speak to Artis and Ervenen, the High Priest at the Sasellum Arden Sul. They can explain what needs to be done. And you've always got our man Haskell to call on for help. Faithful, like a good hound, that one. And... He looks better in a suit. Ta! Come visit again! Or I'll pluck out your eyes! Yes. <laughs> Another sheep. Return. The great torch flares with the light of dementia. All of Crucible will be celebrating tonight. Here, take this. The reward you have earned. Quickly now. It's best if no one knows you wear this. Interesting. Not many wish to hear about such things, but I would be glad to oblige. Becoming the Duke of Dementia requires passage through the Ritual of Accession. Specific guidelines set forth by Arden Sul himself. Seldom is the subject ever br Wait a moment. Did you want to hear the history of the ritual? Very well. Spoken like a true son of the demented. To become the ruler of dementia, the current leader's heart must be cut out and brought to the altar of Arden Sul in the Sasellum. Once this is done, I can pronounce the heart bearer a duke or duchess. Then, all that is required is the blessing of our lord, Sheogorath.
I'm disappointed in your choice. Why you would choose to honor the fetid madness of Dementia is beyond my understanding. An important part of our history, my friend. I would be... Certainly. When the ruler of Mania has decided it is time, he will choose a successor from his court. The successor is invited to a huge celebration, a night of hedonistic revelry, wine, song, and of course, green moat. During this, the exiting regent imbibes three doses of the potent drug. This causes his heart to burst, and his lifeblood flows from his body. The successor then gathers the drug-tainted blood and brings it to the altar of Arden Sul in the Sasellum. Once this is done, I will proclaim the successor a duke or duchess. Then, Sheagorath gives his blessing, and the cycle is completed. How nice for you! Does that mean you've made a decision? Or are you lost? Suicidal? Just let me know. A friendly word of warning before you choose. Once you've decided which duke to replace, there's no turning back. One choice. No more. No less. Try not to do something stupid. So which is it? What will it be? Mania? Dementia? The suspense is killing me! Or you, if I have to keep waiting. A safer choice, perhaps. Maybe you'll live through this. Thaden's a bit lost these days. Not that it's a bad thing, it suits him. <laughs> Until now. Besides, won't it be a grand surprise when you make his heart burst from too much green moat? Satan loves surprises. You have the... Thaden may be in a constant state of euphoria, but I wouldn't underestimate his intelligence. <laughs> this is so much fun! We will speak when your task is complete. How can I help you this fine day? Such a kind and noble man. In times like these, it's good to have a leader who still enjoys all the modern pleasures Mania has to offer. Well, yes, apart from enjoying his painting, reading a good book, or a rousing night of erotic bedroom games. I'm speaking of Greenmoat, of course. There is no greater pleasure. 
such a... Well, yes. Apart from enjoying his painting, reading a good book, or a rousing night of erotic bedroom games. I'm speaking of Greenmoat, of course. There is no greater pleasure. If I didn't have such a busy daily routine, I'd likely indulge myself in its pleasures more often. At the risk of being rude, I must confess I don't like talking about the specifics of my routine. Thaden has too many enemies that may turn that knowledge against him. He depends on me quite dearly. I'm listening. Farewell. How can I... I'm listening. That's great. You're full of it. Is that... Thank you. Oh, you You can't scare me. You're wasting your... You're too kind. That's great. Don't make me laugh. Uh, you're full of it. It's good of you to say so. Oh, that's great. Thank you. Is that... You're full of it. Where'd you... You're full of it. That... How nice. Where'd you get that? That's good. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, I like you, too. You're with... I... To That's really funny. You're full of it. That... I'll I like that. A lot. See? That's right. Very well. I see little harm in telling you. After a bit of reading in the garden and running my special errand at noon, I like to shop at Books of Bliss. Around 8 p.m. we are served dinner. Gundlar is quite a chef and prepares Thaden's meals personally, adding just a hint of green moat. After that, we dance, we sing, or we do whatever else suits my lord's tastes. Green moat is the refined version of the spores that are harvested from the spore trees that dot mania. We keep the green moat safely tucked inside the green moat silo. You can imagine the ruckus if its location was known. Only a select few, such as myself, know the silo's location. However, we are sworn to secrecy. There isn't enough gold or enough jokes in the world that would convince me to tell you where the green moat is located. Yes, I must attend to him. Speaking to you has already cost me time. I must go. <laughs> 